So hi everyone, today we have a special guest on our channel, we have Chirag with us. So Chirag, would you like to introduce yourself? Yeah, hi guys, uh, my name is Chirag Orincha, I am from Sony Pathariana. Uh, I have recently graduated from Chitkar University uh, through BTEC CSC. Currently I am working at Amazon uh, as a software development engineer. Okay, nice. And right now you're working at Amazon, but you yeah. didn't start at Amazon, right? You started at uh, some other company. So how was it like? How did you start your software journey? Uh, yeah, so um, I got a uh, college placement in the in a startup type mm -hmm. company mm -hmm. named Minatomy Integration. Uh, it was initially a good place to mm -hmm. learn uh, uh, much engineering things yeah. at my own pace. Yeah, for from there I started for such big MNCs mm -hmm. to apply for these big MNCs and now I am here at Amazon. Mm -hmm. Nice, nice, nice. So the placement at Amazon was off campus, right? Yeah. yeah. So how did you find the opportunity? Where did you get the opportunity? Yeah, uh, actually the recruiter itself approached me through LinkedIn, okay, uh, nice. LinkedIn DM. Yeah. So from there I started the interview process. Mm -hmm. That's what the only mm, nice. And how was the interview process of Amazon? I've heard it's actually very tough. So how was it? Uh, actually, uh, I think the main uh, tough thing is to shortage mm. uh, your resume at <laughs> such big companies. Yeah. But for this, uh, for mm. my, it was uh, mm. not such a big thing because the recruiter it itself mm. called me. After that, mm. the interviews were was mainly focused on DSA. Mm. That was not much hard and mm. not much. Easy. That I can yeah. say that was average. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, would you like to explain a bit more about your experience? Like, how many rounds were there? Yeah. Uh, so, there were actually, I can say, five rounds. Mm -hmm. One was the uh, first, oh, first one was online assessment. Mm -hmm. It was our main focused on DSA programs. Mm -hmm. After that, uh, there was a uh, screening, mm -hmm. phone screening core. And after that, I had scheduled some one-on-one uh, -on -one interviews, mm. technical interviews mm -hmm. with some SDs and SDs too. There were two uh, interviews with one was one with SD one, mm -hmm. and another was set up with the SD two mm -hmm. uh, These both were only focused on DSPs mm -hmm. like uh, trees and graph topics. I think these were also their main important. Mm -hmm. After cleaning these uh, these two rounds. Uh, there was uh, the final round with the hiring manager. Mm. It was also focused on DSA, but uh, it includes some other past experiences mm. also, uh, like uh, what topics, uh, what work I have done in mm. previous company. That was, I can say, it was all focused on the Zoom. Mm -hmm. What I have mentioned in the Zoom, what skills I have mentioned, there were some topics, some mm -hmm. questions related to that also. So the interviews focus a lot on DSA and problem solving, right? Yeah. So for that, someone needs to be at a good level of DSA preparation. So how did you prepare? You know, what was the preparation journey like? What resources and how did you use? Yeah. Uh, initially, uh, when I was working at uh, my anatomy integration, mm -hmm. there I was uh, struggling by myself for uh, learning these DSA mm -hmm. topics. At that time, I was very mm -hmm. confused, like, uh, which path should I follow, which topic should I cover first mm -hmm. and which when. So for that I uh, for that I approached to Boscoder Academy. Mm -hmm. Actually uh, I saw some uh, LinkedIn post which was uh, um, students mentioning that how Boscoder helped mm -hmm. them to achieve such yeah. big tech companies roles. So I approached to uh, Boscoder Academy. I saw their curriculum and other mm -hmm. things. It like uh, I liked it most, so mm -hmm. I joined Bose Coder Academy. Mm -hmm. and there was a good curriculum which helped me to run uh, these DS, DSA and engineering mm -hmm. topics in a good way. So yeah, that was the my. Mm -hmm. No, that is very experience. true. Like if someone doesn't have a lot of guidance and all, especially if you're coming from a TS3 college, you're stuck mm -hmm. in a job you don't like. It helps if you have guidance, right? Yeah. So how was the Bose Coder course over? Like how did you like it? What all was there? Yeah, so first thing I just I just mentioned that mm -hmm. uh, they have a, be a better curriculum to mm -hmm. follow. Like I was initially struggling with it, mm -hmm. so I liked it. So yeah, apart from this, uh, there was one no, one on one doubt support which mm -hmm. I liked the most. 
uh, like initially when i was solving a dsa programs mm. i got stuck in some uh, way mm. and when i watched some youtube videos they taught some in uh, another way mm. like which uh, which way i was not thinking about mm. uh, but uh, this one on one support helped me to uh, solve my problem in my thinking way mm. like where i was stuck and uh, helped me in my same thinking way to solve that that dsa mm. problem that i liked the most and uh, apart from this there was uh, mentor sessions uh, which that also guided me to mm. uh, follow the good path Mm. Yeah, that's nice, nice, nice. So it's more like personalized to you, right? Because you do yeah. videos and all through it generalized. It's more like generalized, mm-hmm. you know. It doesn't cater to your specific need, ki which area you're struggling in, yeah. right? Yeah. YouTube videos में ऐसा हो जाता था कि हमारी thinking से बिल्कुल ही अलग आ जाता था. हाँ. तो वो थोड़ा दिक्कत आती थी. Like we want to know जहाँ हम direction में जा रहे हैं उस direction से कैसे solve होगा है ना? Rather than following the other person's way of solving. It yeah. इसमें ना ऐसा feel होता था कि मैं बिल्कुल ही गलत सोच रहा था या जो कि मतलब थोड़ा डीमोटिवेट टाइप भी कर देता है कभी कभार सो ऑन अ फाइनल नोट यू नो टू ऑल ऑफ द पीपल हु आर वाचिंग हु आल्सो वांट टू क्रैक अ कंपनी लाइक अमेजोन व्हाट एडवाइस वुड यू गिव टू देम या फॉर देम आई शुड से दैट यू शुड आल्सो फॉलो अ सम गाइडेड वे गाइडेड पाथ फॉर क्रैकिंग सच इंटरव्यूज For freshers, they are mostly based on DSAs only, mm. so keep focus on DSA. Yeah, so that is very true. You know, if you go for a product-based company, DSA, the important thing is yeah. DSA system design. And DSA में काफी लोग stuck भी हो जाते हैं, right? Mm-hmm. It is difficult if you go for the company, if you go for the level of a company like Amazon, Google, ऐसी type की. So it is also difficult. So you can either do yourself, or if you feel like you need help, because काफी लोग require help. काफी लोग से खुद से नहीं कर पाते initially. So if you feel like you are someone who need help. then you can go for a guided play, guided program you know where they teach you how to think they teach you how to develop your problem solving skills uske alawa of course you have youtube you have other resources also that you can manage with right yeah yeah hmm. okay so i guess with that we covered everything about chirag's journey of how he got into amazon so thanks a lot chirag for coming on my channel and sharing all this i hope it helped a lot of students thank you yeah thank you ashish